such a good boy. I think that at the Spartan, you are definitely one of my favorite horses to jump. You're so good. Excuse me, Stephanie. I just need to get through here. Good girl, Aspen. Wait, Jill, isn't that Zeus's stall? Yeah, it was. What do you mean it was? Oh, I, oh, I must have forgotten to tell you. Tell me what? <laughs> Zeus has been sold. What? Is, what you, you, sorry, what? You mean sold as in you don't own him anymore? As in he's leaving the barn? Yeah, um, it's been established for about three or four days now. Well, has the person even come to try him? Well, um, the person's parents um, actually bought him because it's her first horse. Did you think to tell me? Yes, actually I did. As soon as I made it, I was gonna tell everyone. And I told everyone, I guess you must not have been there because I did forget to tell you. Okay, well, I sh absolutely should have savored this ride on him. When does he leave? Tomorrow. Oh my God, Jill. You're telling me that I just spent my last ride on a horse that I love and that I might not get a chance to say goodbye to him for, for, for real? I mean, other than today? Yeah, I guess so, maybe. <sighs> you just melted my heart, just know that. I'm sorry, Stephanie. I really just forgot. I'm so sorry. Oh, it's fine. I guess I'll just go save these last few moments over here. Haha, ha, very funny, Stephanie. <laughs> okay, um, well, where do you want me to put him? Um, he can go to the Geldings and Stallions pasture next to the arena. All right, come on, boy, let's go. Come on, bud. Good boy, buddy. <sighs> uh, hey, Zeus. Hi, right, guys. First of all, why are you so sad? Second of all, why are you in our paddock? You're in daytime for now. Yeah, I was just about to ask both of the same questions. Well, um, I'll answer the second one first. Um, well, actually, I'll answer both of them because they are the exact same answer. Okay, go on. Basically, Jill decided to sell me um, behind my back. I did not find out until today when she said it to Stephanie, which she didn't tell Stephanie either. So... Now I have to leave. Yeah, right, you're leaving. Come on, all the lesson kids and also like Stephanie and people like her, they love you so much. I mean, I swear, if I heard right, Stephanie was just talking about how much she loved you. Yeah, and you're not even her horse, we are. Yeah, see, I don't really get it either because I thought things were going so well. I was getting along with a bunch of horses, I wasn't causing any fights or anything. I was, I thought I was a really good lesson horse and a really good horse in general to, for people to ride, but I don't even know why she's gonna sell me. I guess I wasn't that good. No, 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 I saw you in all those lessons with Lesson Kids and also a bunch of other people from the barn and you looked great. I mean, there's nothing bad about you. Yeah, you're not hot enough to where Lesson Kids can't ride you and you're not slow enough to where it gets kind of, you know, that annoying part. Hi yeah, guys, I really don't get it either. And besides, I'm a beautiful horse. Right? Uh, yeah, I, I guess. Yoo-hoo, Zeus! Oh no, I didn't even think about this. What's Juno gonna think? We've been best friends ever since we were, ever since day one. Since day one of even being alive. Zeus, come here. I I'm getting washed for only a certain amount of time. If you wanna talk to me, then you better come talk to me. Oh, I I'll be there in a second. What am I gonna say, guys? Just tell her. I mean, it's not like she could be mad because it wasn't your decision. Okay, I guess so. Hey, Juno. Hi, Zeus. Um, what's going on? Why do you sound so sad and so worried? Um, because I kind of am, <laughs> in a way. What do you mean? Well, um, I just, just recently, I mean, just like a few minutes ago, I just found out that, um, Jill, <laughs> you know Jill, right? Yeah, of course I know Jill. I come to the same barn as you. Keep going. Yeah, well, um, basically, I guess, I, I guess I haven't really been that good, and so, for some reason, she decided to sell me. Sell you, as in go to a different barn and with a different owner? Yeah, yeah, pretty pretty much. Mm -hmm. What? Why? I've been in lessons with you. I've seen you do lessons. You are, I mean, the perfect horse. You're great at jumping. You're not too hard. You're not too slow. You're not too lazy. You're not, you have 
perfect grand manners? What the heck? Why would she sell you? That's what me and the boys were saying. I haven't done anything to like make her upset. I haven't picked any fights with any horses or any humans for that matter. Well, are you gonna go? <laughs> what do you think? I don't even have a choice. Wow. We've been best friends since day one and we've never been separated. And now you're getting sold. <laughs> and I may never see you again. Yeah, I know. I don't get it. Okay, well, my pasture's all the way over there, so I don't think I'll be able to see you again. I mean, so this is gonna be pretty much the last time that we'll ever see each other again? Yeah, pretty much, I think, maybe. Well, um, uh, I have plenty of things to tell you before you leave, so is there anything that you want to tell me? Um, yeah, I think so. Alright, what is it? Um, I, uh, I... Oh, come on, just say it already. <sighs> I love you. Yes. Oh, thank, thanks, I guess. I love you too. I mean, to be honest, I've been hiding it for years and all the mayors have been joking around with me about it. I've loved you ever since we were yearlings because we've been best friends since birth. Yeah, this is pretty sad now. But, you know, who knows? Maybe we'll, we'll see each other again. I mean, we are both named after God and Goddess, right? So maybe they'll be looking out for us, right? Yeah, let's hope so. All right, well, um, I think Megan's about done here, so see you later. Goodbye, Juno. You okay, bro? Nope, not at all. But, yeah, I think so. I have finally gotten that off my chest. I've been holding it ever since day two of meeting her. Day two of birth, I knew that I loved her, and the feeling's never gone away since. And now at least she knows that I love her. I seem really anxious right now. I feel like I'm I'm pretty anxious for some reason. I mean, really, who wouldn't be anxious when they're about to leave their their home barn, which they've been at for over a year? Thanks for reminding me of it, Lily. Just just know that there will always be a place here for you, Zeus. I mean, I think everyone can agree on it. You're a great gilding, and to be honest, I'm kind of mad that you're a stallion. What? Kidding. <laughs> Partly. Okay, keep going with your speech. And just know that you'll always be missed here by the humans, the dogs, the rabbits, the wild geese that fly around here, and all the horses, of course. <laughs> Thanks. Well, boys, looks like they're here. All right, well, yes. Till next time, Lily. <laughs> of course. You must be Laura. Yep, that's me. I'm Riley's mom. Great to meet you. Don't worry, Zeus will be a perfect fit by what you explained that wish she can do. Um, he's perfect. He's pretty experienced. He's great for beginners and intermediate people and even really experienced people. So I think that your daughter's gonna have a lot of fun. Thanks. Rosso, is it okay if we change his name? I don't really think that she'll be a fan of Zeus. Yeah, of course. I mean, it is your horse now, technically. Well, here's the lead rope. Do you need any help getting him in the trailer? No, I think I got it. All right, here you go. Uh, Jill, thank you so much for him. I can assure you that we'll take great care of him and Riley will be so happy for him. She's always wanted a dapple gray. Of course, and if anything goes wrong, he's always welcome back here at Sapphire Stables. All right, well, thank you so much. Bye. Bye, have a safe trip. Bye, Zeus. Right here in this stall. Is it okay to leave the shipping boots on? No, um, but we'll just let him settle into the stall for a few minutes and then we'll go in and take him off. All right, uh, hi there. Um, I'm Zeus. Hi, Zeus. Colts. Oh, um, okay then. Don't worry about him. He's just always like that. You know what I mean? Yeah, kind of. I do kind of know. So, uh, Zeus, that's your name, right? Yep. I'm Treasure, and just don't ever talk to Rico over there. 
He's kind of always been like that for some reason. Okay, uh, thanks for the tip. <laughs> yeah, of course. So, um, where do you come from? Like, a long way away? Like, up north or down south? Actually, it's not that far away, I don't think. I mean, it was only a little car ride, so I don't think it's that long away. Oh, so you probably still live in the state? Yeah, probably. I mean, I'm not really great at geography or directions or locations or anything, though. Oh, yeah, I don't really think any horses are. Um, are the rest of the horses at, like, a show or something? There seem to be a lot of extra room. First of all, I hope that you didn't mean that as an insult. Second of all, no, there just aren't really a lot of horses here. Oh, yeah, no, I didn't really mean it as an insult at all. I was just asking. Yeah, no, it's okay. It's just, yeah, it's, been, it's kind of been like this, like a ghost town for the past, like, few months and so I mean a lot of horses haven't been coming I'm owned by the owner of the stables and I haven't been getting ridden a lot lately to be honest I think she might be close to closing it because there's just no one here to pay off all these loans and stuff oh yeah then I get a new home yeah well um it's been great to talk to you yeah you too